Hello guys, welcome to Developer Sarita. In this tutorial, I will be teaching you how to make a SMS gateway. So you need to have uh, first thing you need to purchase the script from the Envato or their original their source. You need to have a C panel. You can visit their website rbsoft.org. There is their developers. Then uh, let me see, show you the features. You can directly purchase from here. Scroll down, you can see it is a self hosted web application. Means you need to have your own virtual server or a hosting server. Web source is available here and you can use multiple devices. Okay. You can send USSD request to. Okay, you can here we see PayPal subscription integration. If you are a developer, you can integrate with any of the other payment methods. You can receive directly SMS directly into email. Okay, we can build APK using email servers. Their APK build server. Okay, so just uh, let me open the C panel. Okay, this is my link. Then okay okay cpanel file manager this is the trial version i made it myself i just uh, grabbed the button from the aws just open the file manager open public html just click upload you have upload your script select it uh, wait till it uploads okay it's been uploaded let me just extract it okay you can delete these files i don't you as your wish you can keep it or delete it just go to the your domain just refresh it Okay, you, as you can see, I have every extension enabled. If you don't have extension enabled, you can just go to cPanel, multiple ini editor, enable the extension from there. Okay, let's just, I have, so I have everything fine. Let me just click next. Okay, in the name section and enter your name as your wish okay let me just enter constant prediction better and here email is necessary whenever you need to log in you can use your you need you must use your email never forget it okay if any case if you if forget just go to mysql databases edit it from there and the password I am using the same as email as a password. Database server is, is localhost. Whenever you are hosting it on a cPanel or GoDaddy or any kind of a hosting servers, look database service every time localhost. Okay, so first thing we don't have any database name, so let me just go to the cPanel, then scroll down databases, MySQL databases. Just click on it. okay so we need to create a new database let me just create it demo sms create a database okay this is my database name let me just copy it okay database user let me go back scroll down okay here you can see add a new user tab so I will be using same thing as a username. Click just password generator. Copy the password. Do this password. Paste it. Okay, just click create a user. 
just let me, I have used it. So just click go back. Okay, first thing we need to add user to the database. So just Let's click add. Check all the privileges, then make changes. Click go back. That's it. And then go back to the SMS installation page. Here is the main thing Firebase server key and Firebase center ID. So if you fail to add this key or any kind of errors in the key, you can't connect to the app. Just go to the open new tab. Go to Firebase console. Enter it. And open console dot Firebase dot Google dot com. And then, okay. Just let me. This is uh, for the new case. I have already made. So just if you are new beginner, just click on Add Project. You can see I have many made demos. Okay, just click add project, then enter the project name as you wish. So I will write as DA demo, developer certain demo. I will confirm, just click continue, then continue again. Select your default Firebase account. Just create a project. Let's create a project. Then providing the resources. Wait till it completes. It may take just few minutes or few seconds, depending upon your network speed. Okay, just click continue. Open the project overview. Then you can go to project settings, cloud messaging. You can see server key and sender ID. Okay, you can see cloud messaging API disabled. Okay, so as I this is my free account, I made many kind uh, many projects. So I just have to go back to my project old projects so I can get other key. Same thing again. Let me just okay, doesn't shift. Yeah, okay, shifted. Okay, scroll down, cloud messaging is. Yeah, you can see the server key and the sender ID. Right? So, we just need to copy the server key and the sender. Just let me copy sender ID first. Go back to the installation page, paste it, and then close this all apps. Yeah, sender server key paste it and enter your purchase code let me grab my purchase code from Envato I will cut this part Okay, you can see this SMS case installation has been success. Okay, so you need to add a con job. What is our use of con job? Use nothing but us. It will send the emails every frequently every once a minute. I think um, in this case, same thing applies. Okay, open, scroll down find the con jobs it should be an advanced tab scroll down scroll down mm, yeah advanced tab con job just click on it and common settings once per minute and just you to copy the and uh, once per minute Add new con job successfully. That's it. And click sign in. 
Let's see if you can use your um, email like admin address reused and same thing I use as a password. Just click sign in. You can see a SMS gateway has been made and you have to just whenever you are trying to connect with the app you need to install the SMS gateway APK provided by the RBsoft. Just you, it's, it is same like WhatsApp web. Scan the QR code, link it with the app, and that's it. You need to connect. And you have to in the right bottom corner there is a play button. Just click on it. It will be showing SMS gateway started, and you have to allow the permission to the battery optimization. That's it. This is for the video. Thanks for watching.